We're cock locked, ready to rock. Here we go. All right, start at the top. Yeah, sweet Kimber, ultra crimson carry two pie. Let's go get us some of this. Oh yeah. Oh, what a flinch. <laughs> hey guys, Big Daddy Hoffman 1911 coming to you. What you got in front of you is a Kimber. And this is the Ultra Crimson Carry 2. This one I've had for a few years. When they first came out with it, I bought it and I carried it for about a year. It started, it started showing a little wear because I like the Phobos type holsters. And I bought a uh, leather holster to go with it. So, thinking about starting to carry this one again. You know, I like my Glock Model 30. Both of them are 45, but this Kimber's awful sweet, I'll tell you that. There's a difference in size in them right there. I think you can see that there. Glock's a lot wider. Old power tool there. But Kimber sure is pretty, isn't it? Yes, indeed. All right, this guy has got an on and off switch for your laser. It does come with the laser grip. And it also comes packing seven in a magazine and one in the pipe if you want to go that route. So we're going to shoot this one a little bit more. And let me load her back up. All right, I got her loaded back up. That's how she looks with the slide open there. Let's give it another whirl. Put it on safety. Get my eyes and ears back on. Be ready to go. Let's see if I can do a little bit better this time. All right. See if you can see that laser. Oh, yeah. Let's see if we can knock down one of these guys right here. The only thing I don't like about this one, put it back on safety. I like the laser, and it's a great tool at night, but I can't see black on black when I'm shooting these targets. But that's, that's my excuses for not being able to shoot, I guess. Let's kill this buffalo. Okay. Let's put another mag in there. See what we can do. Okay, here we go. Let's put her into the gong. We're ready to rock. My laser's showing up pretty good right now. That's not too bad a pattern. Let me zoom in there hair for you. Okay, that's the pattern we got on those rounds into the gong. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. All right, let me zoom back out here. All right, I moved her back over here. Let me try these targets. Maybe they'll light me a little bit better. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Now I can see it. Let's try that uh, bad guy. All right, guys, let's try this dueling tree. 
see how bad I can mess this one up. We're cock locked, ready to rock. Here we go. All right, start at the top. One more. Little deal. Okay, it's not too bad. I know you guys can see that laser and see how bad I'm shaking here, but it's okay. I ain't dead yet. Let's do it again. Let's see for the hot. Little deal. That was a little better. Oh yeah. Okay, let me get you a side shot. Here we go. A lot of ringing steel there. That's what I'm talking about. All right, one more spin and we'll close this one out. I think you can see the laser a little bit better now that the sun's gone down. Oh yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> well, that's not the best shooting in the world, by far. I think my desire to shoot and my overall physical health is having a battle. Anyway, guys, there's a lot I wanted to tell you about this one. Um, you know how how nice, good shooter it is, and I get I get it back out here on the range and do this again. Um, it's just too hot out here, and I'm stumbling too much. I think I. Took about five takes when I first started this video, which is not abnormal. But uh, you'll be seeing this Kimber again. This is one I, one of the ones I carry. I either carry this one um, or the Glock, and I carry the 357 Airlite for backup. So she's a nice, nice pistol. If you get a chance to shoot one, I would recommend it. 100%. I trust this as a as a carry pistol, a good EDC pistol. Guys, if you like this video, please like, favor, and subscribe. And forgive me for messing the video up and for sweating so much. <laughs> Remember, Big Daddy loves you. Hoorah. I'm going in.